Okay, Joe's RTG help here. This is a tutorial on Tux Guitar. It's quite a cool uh, application from both Mac, Windows, and possibly Linux. Um, pretty much the same layout on all operating systems. So, when I first approached this, it looked pretty difficult, but it's a lot easier than I thought. So, if you were wanting to do sort of notes, you can come and click where you want the notes to go up here. Click them to delete them. And if you're here to do the tab, which quite a lot of you will be, um, you can click down here on what string. So I'll go to the E string, push a zero. And then you can come up to here, push a one, two, three, etc. Then you can push the right arrow key and it'll bring you a new bar. And I'll just work my way down. And you'll also see up here, it's been putting in the notes as well, for note reading. So if I click at the start and push play, it's played back what I've done. So if you want to carry on, you just go back to your last bit, press the right arrow key, and you can type in more numbers, like that. And then you can click where you want to start playing it from and hit play. And if you were wanting to listen to your track over and over again because you wanted to edit it, you come up to player, click play mode, and go play looped. You can also change the tempo, so I'll change it to 150%, then click OK. Now if we come up to play, it will be a wee bit faster and it will loop, so it will keep playing. Yeah, so it keeps playing over and over again. You can also change instruments. There's many instruments on this. So if you come down here to instrument, double click on the instrument there, and then come to this box, click on this, scroll up and down and choose what you wanted. So I'll turn mine into a violin just to see how it goes. Yeah, there's a few different instruments there, so try one more choir, let's see how that works you can't really do, that's not the best um, some other features are you can obviously print your sheet out, I'll attach one of my sheets that I've made, it's a blues track so it's quite cool so what you do, you come up here, file and I first come up to composition and click properties and you want to give it a name so I'll call it tutorial track then you write the artist name which will just be Joe's ICT help album I don't have an album author Joe's ICT help date so let's put the date there then you can talk comments and fill in the rest of the gaps. Push OK. Now if we come up to File, Print Preview, push OK. This is what it looked like when it gets printed off. So it's quite professional if you've got quite a lot. Um, so page name at the bottom, which is also helpful. Okay, so this is my blues track that I created earlier. Uh, I'll play it for you. I'll just give it a bit of extra. Um, speed So you'll see that they got the bars down here, so you can skip to a bar by clicking on it. So also got the bar names up here. So that's my tutorial on Tuckers Guitar. And this tab will be attached in the link. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe.